It is March 19th, 50 degrees in Chicago. <laughs> And we are going to see Olivia Rodrigo at the United Center. We have some pretty cute outfits planned out and we're going to take you along for the ride. And we're going to see what the average age is there because I am 26 and I'm going to feel very old. But it'll be great. It's fine. All right, let's go. You guys get the very unesthetic lighting that is this bathroom. I got this super cute bow from Claire's and I thought it'd be good with like wavy hair. So we're gonna try to curl my hair without burning myself. I'm just going to touch base with you guys when this is done. We're going to shake this out and then do the makeup. Let me know if I missed any. If I did, I will. Naturally, for makeup, we have to have glitter. And then we got the, I got these little stars off of Amazon that we're gonna put, like, I saw people do, like, around here. I'm not a makeup guru, so we're gonna do the bare minimum and just hope for the best. We're just gonna take the sparkliest one and throw it on there. Look at that. I'm obsessed. Oh my god. And last we have is I've never tried lip stain before, but apparently tonight is the night. We're gonna try it. I never do my lips. This is scary. <laughs> it's uneven. Well, that's uneven. <laughs> Dude, I look like a vampire. <laughs> Should I lean into it? <laughs> oh my God. Have you seen the video of the person's brother who dressed up as a vampire? Someone like literally like went like white face cloak. <laughs> I'm like, I kind of love that. Oh, All right. Oh. It was recorded this whole time and we got here. We are gonna add the stars. We have to run an errand because someone needs earplugs. But we're gonna do dress, bow, stars when we get back. And we also have to eat dinner before we go. Oh my gosh. We're gonna do the stars and the outfit now. So. She's cute. Look at the bow. The stickers are from Amazon. Bow is from Claire's. It has little butterflies in it. Oh my god. Shirt is from Etsy. Colored bra is from a friend. Then really go back here. Leather pants are from Francesca's. Tights are from Amazon. Really tight all off. Who 
Holy my sunglasses are from also my nose is so crooked. Can we look at this? Sunglasses are from a party one I went to and they were party favors. And then we have a matching bag. What do I have in this? Hand sanitizers and tampons. Very important. So this is the look. You can't even see it. Hold on. I forgot to note these bracelets are also from Claire's. Look at the little butterflies. They're so cute. Okay. eating beforehand some spring rolls. They look a little scary, but they're made by yours truly. Make sure you eat. Hello, people. Excuse the lighting and the look. <gasps> we just got back. We're gonna, we'll do a quick debrief after this when I'm a little bit more coherent. Just quite sleep deprived and tired and also so excited that she announced Guts Deluxe coming out at Chicago this coming Friday. But it was amazing, 10 out of 10. Literally the best vibes. The opener, Chappelle, Chapel, Chapel, I forgot her second name. The second part of her name, oh my gosh, amazing. So fun. The average age was definitely young, but we'll go into all that later. I'm gonna go smash some spring rolls and I'll see you guys in a, in a bit when I'm, we can talk about the pictures and everything and everything that went down. But for now, good night. I'm gonna go eat. <laughs> Let's do a quick recap. So overall, 10 out of 10 experience. So much fun. Highly, highly recommend going to see Olivia Rodrigo. Also, Chapel and Roan was incredible. I am so sad. I've never listened to any of her music before seeing her open for Olivia, but now I have so many of her songs downloaded. I'm so excited. And she's coming, I think, to Lala this year, so. Might have to mess around and see her. I went with my sister and my friend Amanda. We arrived about 30 minutes before chapel started. And I will note, like we weren't gonna, we already kind of got Olivia Rodrigo shirts from online and Etsy. I've also seen people find them in Target for like half the price or like a third of the price. So highly recommend doing that. If you wanna be a little bit more money conscious, but I will note, I saw that there was an exclusive, like I spilled my guts in Chicago shirt, so that would have been kind of cool. I think you could still order it online, but that's really cool. We kind of walked around the venue beforehand. Olivia's been very outspoken about how she's using a lot of proceeds and advocating for 
female reproductive rights. And there was a table about abortion rights and whatnot, which we love. This is a pro-choice household. We stand. We just kind of like walked around, took cute pictures, took some little ticky tocks. And then this is kind of where we were sitting. We spent, I think about, I think it was like 80, $90 a ticket for each of us. And we were in like the top section, which was still a great view. As you can see, like you could still see everything quite well. And then that was kind of it. Definitely if you want to get merch, I would show up much, much earlier because the lines were so long. And then I know that she had her little like bus you could go in and whatnot and like check out. We ended, we didn't end up doing that, but that would be something really cool to check out as well. And Bobby drove us there and back. So we didn't have to deal with the Uber situation because that would have been a mess. I don't know, it was just so fun dressing up and being cute. I've only been to two other concerts in my life, both of those being Backstreet Boys concerts, so you don't really dress up all that too much for it. It was also like I went in high school and it was a lot of middle-aged women and great, great time, had a great time. But this was really fun to like dress up and whatnot and be cute and have fun and sing with Olivia. I think that's everything I have to say. If you have any questions, comment them below. Hopefully I can help. But thanks for tagging along guys, this was so fun had a great time. Be sure to like and subscribe or else I will cry. And we'll see you next week. But otherwise this was so fun. I'm probably going to Lala this year, so maybe we'll do well maybe we'll do a little Lala vlog. That'd be crazy. That'd be crazy. All right. Bye.